the Gordon Stakes is next. This is a one mile four furlong race. It's for older horses as well in the 07. At the top we've got Bravery Antique for David Robertson. Spring into action. Craig Beckwith, Las Trapanga. Darren Thompson, Nature Queen, Leon Van Rensburg, Santa Rosa Fruit, Winnie Gerard, Hellfire Pistol, David Robertson, Home of the Brave, Paul Rhodes, Morville, Daniel French, Valento Rider, Dan Hughes, Empire of Angels for Paul Rhodes, and Joshua Sutherland has got the bottom pair, Money Pit and Warning Signs, a field of 12. In and away, this always used to be a St. Ledger trial, this one, but it's not so much of a St. Ledger trial in SO7. Land has been got the four year olds in it, but it's Santa Rosa Fruit who's gone off into the lead from Bravery Antique in second, then Money Pit and Empire Angels, and then Last Trapanga. But then Bravery Antique has come through to take the lead. Money Pit, though, has got the rail and might well force its way through on the inside. They're pretty tightly grouped through the first couple of furlongs, and Bravery Antique is now settled into the lead. Money Pit, home of the Brave Warning Signs behind them, then comes Empire of Angels after that one, Lastra Panga is next, the grey over on the far right is Santa Rosa Fruit, that one actually just dropped back, so we almost a back mark, and now Morville probably just got back spot, but it's Bravery Antique who's got the lead, the one closest to us is its stable mate, that's Hellfire Pistol in mid division, but I mean, the second is home of the Brave, they're inside the final mile now, and Bravery Antique it's a good two lengths clear of Home of the Brave in second. Then comes Money Pit and Warning Signs. Empire of Angels is after that one. Spring into action. He's trying to do just that. Then comes Lastra Panga. Hellfire Pistol is after that one. Then Nature Queen and Valento Rider trying to get into it. Santa Rosa Fruits drop right out of it out the back. But it's Bravery Antique who's in front. Bravery Antique is in the lead then by a good four lengths or so now to Home of the Brave. Money Pit and Warning Signs. Then comes Morville who's, who's making some good ground. Spring into action is next then after that one Valento Rider and Empire of Angels Nature Queen and Lastra Panga Santa Rosa Fruit is now starting to weave away through the field but it's Bravery Antique with four furlongs to go two lengths clear of Home of the Brave in second Money Pit and Warning Signs are next then a gap to Morville and Valento Rider Empire of Angels is after that one then Santa Rosa Fruit trying to get into it Lastra Panga is after that but it's still Bravery Antique with three to go Bravery Antique then from Warning Signs and Home of the Brave then Money Pit Empire of Angels Home of the Brave is coming through now as well. Also after that one is Morville. Nature Queen trying to run on, but it's Bravery Antique. He's three or four clear again. Off Home of the Brave and Warning Signs. Empire of Angels in Las Trapanga. Money Pits now starting to drop away. Morville's trying to run on. Santa Rosa Fruit still tr trying to get through. They're inside the final firm and Bravery Antique has slipped the field. And Bravery Antique is well clear still. Racing into the final half firm. Bravery Antique is keeping going. And he's not going to be caught. I don't think Home of the Brave is going to have one last chance to get to him. But it's going to be Bravery Antique and Tanky Home of the Brave, second morning size, third, then Valento Rider and Morgan and Empire Angels after that one. And spring into action, sadly didn't, and was the last one to finish for Craig Beckwith. But it's Bravery Antique for David Robertson, who takes it. Home of the Brave, second for Paul Rhodes, warning sign, Joshua Sutherland, third, Valento Rider, Dan Hughes, fourth, and Morville for Daniel French was fifth.